Bots and Books fans, this is Scorp1701, and tonight we are going to be taking a look at the exclusive TargetCon 2022 Limited Edition Pop Rides Masters of the Universe He-Man on Battle Cat figure. And this is a beautiful little pop, and we have He-Man on Battle Cat, and Battle Cat is purported to be flocked, as the sticker says here. And that means he is going to be fuzzy, and I can't wait to get him out of here. But let's take a look at this Target exclusive box first. Up at the top, you have Pop Rides, you have Masters of the Universe number 84. You can see He-Man and Battle Cat in there. You have Flocked, you have Funko Target Con 2022 Limited Edition Exclusive. You have He Man on Battle Cat here. On the side of the box, you just have Pop Rides. You have He Man on Battle Cat number 84. On the other side of the box, Pop Rides 84. He Man on Battle Cat. On the top of the box, He Man on Battle Cat. Pop Rides Funko. On the bottom of the box, you have some words and Credits for the box and a barcode and that is all well and good. And finally, on the back of the box, you have He-Man on Battle Cat, Pop Rides, Masters of the Universe 84, and some more figures from this particular line. Clamp Champ, Drag Store, Evil Lynn, Horde Trooper, Merman, collect them all. And you have some more credits for the box right here. And that's basically it for the box. But no one wants to see this awesome exclusive Target Pop in the box. I know I don't. So let's get him out and see what he can do. And here we have He-Man and Battle Cat out of the box. And they look fantastic. I love the way that this came out. You can see he is very nicely done. He is sculpted in a very action-esque pose with his sword reaching out forward there and his arm out here you can see a very nice metallic chest piece with the red cross really love that classic he-man design and then you got some orange for his bracers and belt right here and then you got his brown shorts coming down to his legs molded in to battle cat so he does not come off if you were wondering now he is stuck on there Nice brown boots, and that brings you to the Battle Cat saddle, which is really nice. Nice big huge helmet, black eyes for Battle Cat. You got the uh, horns coming out the top of the Battle Cat helmet, and you have the four teeth, which are uh, indicative of the toy, and I think that is what this was going on, because you have this cool little saddle, again, that looks exactly like the toy you have the little yellow streaks coming down his body. And yes, this is a flocked version. You can feel it. It is very fuzzy textured all the way down to his tail and his mouth. And even his teeth. <laughs> his teeth are flocked, which is crazy. I don't know why you wanted to do that. But hey, fuzzy teeth, I guess, hurts less when he chomps you. <laughs> Got a nice fuzzy tongue in there. And it's pink. I love that. Black eyes. And that is really cool. Uh, there is no articulation in the figure except, like all Funko Pops, the head of the main figure, uh, He-Man here, will move around 360 degrees. And I think that is really cool. And kind of going back up to his head. Let me uh, zoom out a little bit. That's a little close. Going back up to his head, which I kind of miss. You see uh, He-Man has his nice golden hair, some very stern angry eyebrows and pop eyes and nose and that is really cool on the back his chest piece does continue you can see that and the belt continues around so that is cool on the bottom of the figure we do have a little bit of uh, copyright information on his feet so here we zoom in there we can get a little good reading here you have where it says Funko LLC 2021, www.funko.com, made in Vietnam, and then you have 2021 Mattel right over here. Wait, wait, 2021? Wait a second. When is this the 2022 Target exclusive? They lie! <laughs> no, um, this was actually put out. Uh, in 2021, I guess, and I believe that was just a regular version that wasn't flocked because I remember he came out before the Masters of the Universe rides She-Ra on Swiftwind. So they took this, redecoed it, and flocked 
Battle Cat here so that you could have him for a Target exclusive. And this is the Season 4 exclusive, so there are probably going to be a lot more out there. And uh, yeah, this is a great, great looking figure. And uh, let's get something out here to compare him with. And for comparison, here you have the Funko Pop version of He-Man with the new Mattel Battle Cat from last year and the Super 7 He-Man, which I think is the best He-Man out there when it comes to replicating the cartoon. And I think these two look awesome. They are the spitting image of one another. If He-Man was from the Pop Universe and they do a multiverse crossover, so they could be running together. So yeah, I really love these two figures and they look exactly the same. Just, you know, like I said before, if one was like shrunk down. So that is cool. All right. Moving on. And for a pop comparison, kind of, this is the Walmart exclusive Masters of the Universe Pop Rides Shira on Swift Wind. Now, this belongs to Queen Bravo, and this should only be opened under pain of death, and I'm not that brave yet. <laughs> so, you can kind of see uh, the comparison in there. They are pretty much the same size. Obviously, Swift Wind's got wings, and that is just going to be a really cool comparison. Again, sorry that I can't actually take this out but i think this works just as good all right moving on and for some other pop comparisons here he is with dark wing duck that is nice and coming up a little bit so yeah it's cool and here he is with optimus prime and see yep that's, he is really big there like that like that a lot and here he is with the zombie wolverine bobblehead. Ah, come here, Bob. <laughs> and, uh, well, you know, I think uh, He-Man could take him, chop his head off, ah, finish this guy off for good. <laughs> and finally, here he is with Pop John McClane. And that is really cool. I like the way these two look together. But again, they're not that great of comparisons because, well, he's in the deluxe rides and these are just singles. But eh, that's what we got, so that's what we're going to use. All right, moving on. And this has been the Target exclusive Pop Rides Masters of the Universe He-Man on Battle Cat figure. Part of the Funko Target Con 2022 limited edition exclusive. And this was released about four months ago in March. And all I can say is this is a great figure. You have an awesome sculpt of He-Man on the Battle Cat. And the flocked version of Battle Cat here is so cool and fuzzy. I love it. He was never flocked in the toy, but, you know, hey, it's a special exclusive edition, so let's make him flocked. Now, I did plan on picking this up four months ago when it was released, but I waited, and I sure am glad I did, because I found this awesome exclusive this morning at the target in my area and it had gone on clearance i bought two of them just so i could prove to you that i am not crazy now when this came out it was roughly 30 dollars 29.99 and i thought even though it was human that was a lot to pay for this particular pop even though it was exclusive even though it was flocked but, you know, I still kind of wanted it, and I had this in my hands more than once to check out with. But for one reason or another, I always put it back. But today, I could not because I found this on clearance. And I am going to zoom in, and I am going to show you that at my target, this thing was on clearance for $8 dollars and 99 cents nine dollars and as you can see it was 29.99 i could not pass this up it was so good a deal i got two of them and i can see why target did this when this came out it was everywhere and they had tons of them filling up the racks but now no one seems to want it so they got to get rid of it somehow 
clearance was their idea and nine dollars this is gonna be a steal so if you are looking for this he-man on battle cat exclusive target item rush out to your targets right now and you may find it on clearance for nine bucks i bought two of them and it still didn't add up to the price of one when it was originally released so Sometimes patience is a virtue and all good things come to those who wait. All right, guys, that is the video. I hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, keep playing.